have you noticed that there's a button missing on Team Termite's front page? Usually shows up mm, about right here. It's a nice blue button that says join on it. Team Termite has a huge announcement to make. At f exactly 4,000 subscribers, Team Termite will be releasing Team Termite memberships. You probably remember this from the community post I made a week ago, and in that community post, I also said if the community post reached 100 likes, which you guys absolutely destroyed, I would be revealing the benefits of becoming a Team Termite membership. So first off, Team Termite memberships, what are they called? How much do they cost? What are their benefits? So. Team Termite membership only has one tier for now, maybe in the future I'll add more tiers, but the membership is for $4 Canadian a month, which is not expensive at all, but don't worry if you can't buy it, subscribing is just fine to me. And the name of it is Team Termite Plus Rank. This will let you get uh, badges by the side of your name and also emojis that you can use in comments or even during live streams. Your badges will also show up during live streams to make you look like a huge termite fan. So what are the benefits of becoming a Team Termite Plus? Well, let me tell you. First benefit is you will get a shout out in the beginning of every single video and live stream I make as long as you're a member. Your name will pop up on the screen with a special thanks to the members uh, just to show my appreciation for all of you that will become members. And second, I will accept your friend request on Cubecraft. That's right. I will accept your friend request on Cubecraft, and I will definitely invite you to parties when I feel like I need a duo or just to have some fun with some channel members. So yeah, help Team, Mer help team Termite hit 4,000 subscribers as soon as possible so we can release channel memberships so all of you can get these awesome benefits. For now, let's get right to the video. What's up, everybody? That, that's not my duo. This man right here is my duo, actually. <laughs> Welcome, everybody, to a brand new video. Today, we're doing a collab with the one and only Nexern, the god and legendary player himself. And if you notice, there's a little twist. We are going to be playing some Egg Wars duos together, running a couple games. But if you look at the sky and some shades of the blocks. I'm using a texture pack. This is a pretty cool texture pack. Um, I'm using this texture pack kind of to like, I don't know, advertise it since Nexturn updated his texture pack. Uh, I really like this texture pack and you should definitely go check it out. But anyways, without further ado, let's get right to the epic gameplay. Oh yeah! Alright, here we are in the modern map. And if you're already looking, there's a whole bunch of blocks that have their own texture and stuff. Like, specifically, you can see the glass right now. The glass looks really cool. <laughs> I kind of like it. So this is called, I believe, the Red Berries Pack. It's made by someone, edited by CHR7ST. I've also featured a couple times on this channel. He's a legend, too. But yeah, overall, I've played with this pack a bit. And it's kind of featured... Uh, I guess you could say the main color of this is red. Everything is supposed to have a kind of a red-ish shade to it, or dark. Which I find really nice, uh, since I guess that's like Nexer's main color anyways. It makes total sense. And the update um, is he didn't change any of the block textures, but he changed the sky. As you can see, there's a custom sky. And if I'm being honest, I've always kind of wanted a custom sky. Like, I've, I've liked real JCG's... Um, nighttime sky for quite a while, but I don't know exactly. They don't all look like something I, I specifically want. Like, I want something a bit better than just nighttime, and I don't want something super colorful like a ridiculous galaxy thing. Like, sure, that'd look cool, and this man's gonna try and suicide jump. But yeah. Oh, also, I almost forgot to mention, it should be in the title too, but anyways, I'm on PC. For the sole fact, I literally would play on Switch. I would much rather play on Switch for videos and stuff. But uh, sadly, I cannot get custom texture packs on Switch, at least not legally, I think. <laughs> I think there's a way you can crack your Switch or something, get Android on it, and then make yourself a custom texture pack and put it on. Which, to be honest, I kind of wish I could do, but I, don't, I also don't want to break the law and get Nintendo to ban me 
from online play, so yeah, I, I guess I'm just gonna have to play on PC like this for now, and this man's just gonna go in. I also really do enjoy the short swords, and uh, the crosshair's pretty cool too. I mean, I'm not used to having a circle, but it, it's interesting. It's pretty decent, and we already won the game. That was a two minute, four second game. That was really fast, nice. All right, so here we are in game number two. We're gonna get some pretty fast victory royales. Yeah, at this rate, we're gonna be recording quite a few games if we're gonna get two minute games. It's pretty crazy. Oh, three games, okay, sure. All right, here we are at Dark Blue's base. Goodbye, egg. First rush completes. Goodbye, player. Oh, hello. If you didn't know, I'm much better at PvP on PC. But, like I already mentioned in a couple of videos, I enjoy playing Switch a bit more. I don't know, like... Of course, I'm not as good on Switch, like, at all. Like, I'm actually pretty bad at Switch, to be honest. <laughs> but, it's it's just a lot more fun to play using a controller. I don't know. I feel like PC has such a crazy advantage that it's almost not fair. But at the same time, I, I use PC since I'm a lot better at it to grind. Like, if I'm gonna be grinding some leaderboard games and stuff, I'll play on PC. Um, I'm going for this team. Nope. I'm already here. You didn't even see me. Oh, I also like the crit particle hit effects. Those are so cool. I'll showcase that in a minute, but quickly kill this man. Die. Where are you going? Stop running. No running. Thank you. Okay, and if you look, they have like the, the little bar as the block destroying effect sort of thing rather than like the actual effect yeah this pack is some pretty cool stuff kind of like chr7 st's signature um designs like in, in most of his packs he'll have short swords he really likes short swords i i like them too the crit special crit particle effects um some pretty nice i really like the um enchanted effects too, those are cool. And this man's just building up, he's not actually doing anything worthwhile, so I'm just gonna punch. Nice. Well, GG, that's that. Alright, nice, and so now we get to see it in nighttime, actually, seeing as we got the, um, new October map, which is pretty epic. Um, see a couple cool things, like the sky got a lot darker of a red shade, which is pretty cool. You know, if I'm being honest, I kind of wish I had a PvP pack. Like, yes, I, ha I can do any pack. I can even get someone to make me a pack if I play on PC. But then I don't have it on Switch. And Switch is kind of like Team Termite's signature uh, station to play on. So that kind of totally ruined the point of it if I, I get a pack, but I can't even use it on the main thing I play for the channel. So I believe Nexurn actually has been grinding bed wars on nether games a lot more than he's been playing cubecraft lately which is pretty cool I, I i like it too i'm just i'm kind of super stuck on trying to climb the leaderboards even though i got knocked down like 17 spots or something because school started which is pretty cool but i'm i'm slowly trying to climb my way back up we'll see how it goes Oh, one more thing I should mention. Okay, so now that I've lost a piece of hunger, listen to the eating sound effects. That's in many of CHR7ST's packs. He loves those eating sound effects. I believe it's also on, um, what's that, the Hyperlands pack or something. Uh, that's a pretty good pack, but I CHR7ST makes... I feel like he's kind of underrated, to be honest. He makes really good stuff. Alright, this is gonna be our last game um, on uh, this video with this pack. That'll be pretty cool. Oh, we got some targeters in here. This is FX Voids and some other non. <laughs> I'm just kidding. FX Voids has been trying to 
take my leaderboard spot. I think we've had like a fight going back and forth for this spot for like three months now. Every time he gets like within 100 wins from me, I just kind of grind the heck out of the game. It's pretty hilarious. I kind of feel bad. I passed him a really long time ago, but that was because he was AFK. Okay, they're on red team, so I believe they aren't on the same side as us. Goodbye. Wait, there's two, there's two chickens in this game. There's Chicken Spit and Chicken Gamer. Oh my goodness, this is top 10 anime battles right here. So I'm guessing they're, they're gonna try and go full sweat on us. I'm not necessarily surprised about, so I'll tr I'll try and play safe. I have a bit of confidence since I'm on PC, but it's, it's something. Alright, I'm gonna quickly get rid of this guy. Hello, chicken gamer. My back is towards the void. This is kind of bad. I'm lagging. Canadian internet is great. Stone swords are great too, by the way. Why do I lag when there's a pro? What do you mean? You won the battle. I was the one that was lagging. You saw that epic lag spike. Oh, rip. Hello, chicken spit. Goodbye, chicken spit. Isn't a chicken spit that thing that, like, rotates around and grills from the sides? Those are really tasty. And of course, first hit of the battle, I lose a piece of hunger. You know what, let him get our egg, I'm gonna go for theirs. And I cannot maneuver around. Oh my gosh, uh... Okay, that man's dead. FX Voids is gonna come up from behind if I don't quickly eliminate this guy. Alright, you can run away. Ah, uh, sweaty situations. Okay. Oh, they're splitting up! Yes! So what I'm gonna do is actually go like this, and I'm gonna get some golden apples. There, okay, I scared him away. He's gonna try and get his teammates so they can do a 2v1, which is smart. I'll put my normal chest plate on just to fight you, but if your teammate comes in, I'm gonna just dip. Alright. Yeet. Okay. He's everywhere. This man is everywhere. And goodbye. That right there is how you clutch a 2v1. I didn't even use my iron chest plate. I didn't even use my iron chest plate. <laughs> That's gonna be it, guys. I want to thank Nexern so much for joining me in this video. I want to thank him so much for giving me early access to his amazing pack. Definitely go check out the pack. I'll leave a link not only to his POV of this collaboration in the description, but also a link to his pack release so you guys can download it once it comes out, because this pack is literally amazing. For now, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to smash like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye!